Hi, hello and welcome to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Veronica and I'm a big lover of makeup. So if you want to see more reviews, looks and uh, more fun videos, don't forget to subscribe. So today we are filming another empties video, but today I will sprinkle on some decluttering product. I have this bag in here. Let's start with some something random. First on the top is the body wash from that. So I'm not gonna brag about it, just uh, I finished another one. And if we talk about uh, body washes, I have this one in here. It's from Balea, it's from DM. And uh, I think it's a very good smelling <laughs> body wash. I think I finished it up too uh, fast. So um, I think you need a lot of product to uh, foam up and uh, it's not my favorite. We have the Tutti Frutti pear and cranberry sugar body scrub. I love this uh, scrub. I think I have like three or four uh, because I'm just loving that. Then this is not my favorite smell, the pear and cranberry, but they are smelling great and they are um, exfoliating my skin, uh, my uh, body very good. And the smell is divine. The product is divine and it's very affordable. I'm really loving it okay so let's move on into some decluttering products uh, of course they are not uh, finished i'm just decluttering them i will uh, pass them uh, onto a friend in this way the product is not wasted so i think it's a good uh, good thing to do like this first is the shine loud from nyx it's not my favorite product so i will declutter it and I think maybe one of my friends can uh, enjoy this one. And as well the NYX uh, Lift and Snatch. Maybe one of my friends are loving the feathery brows more than me. So I think maybe they could enjoy this product more than me. And then I have this LA Girl Pro Conceal. I don't really like this product. Again, I will pass it on. Maybe some someone else could, could enjoy it. But I don't think it's co it has coverage enough and it's a bit drying and weird so it's not my favorite unfortunately and then i will throw this away because it's broke and i can't twist it it's a faulty packaging this is the la girl ultimate uh, lip liner i like the product but what can you do <laughs> next i will declutter this milk pencil because i have another two green pencils and I don't think uh, I need more. Again, I will maybe pass on to a friend this product because I think it's a good liner, but um, I, I don't want to go bad because I can't use three green liners. <laughs> this Ebelin solution is to clean your brushes. Uh, again, it's from DM. I don't like uh, the product to be used uh, how it's to, <laughs> supposed to be used. Uh, you su are supposed to uh, spray this on a brush and clean it on a tissue and I don't like that. Maybe you could um, clean a bit some a bit of maroon or cream or something like that but I don't think I can clean a hot pink with this so I'm not really liking it in that way but I mix it with uh, some water and leave my uh, brushes in there to sit a bit and this uh, clean my brush is a bit easier than uh, just using water and soap so I think I will repurchase it to leave my brushes in there. The next product is the Schwarzkopf Gliss Hair Repair is a 4-in-1 mask. I like this as a conditioner so just put it on let it a bit to sink in and then rinse it out. I don't think it's my favorite kind of product so I will not repurchase this. I much prefer conditioner in general than masks, so yeah. Then we have the Ionique Black Snake Restore Cream. So these products. <laughs> First, I thought I like this one, but then I think this product broke me out. I'm not sure if um, this caused some pimples. I can't be sure, of course, but... I stopped using it and I have a bit more clean skin now so but I use it up I had a bit left and I put it on my legs and uh, yeah not my favorite 
product. I have the Ordinary Niacinamide. I'm really liking this. If you have oily skin, this will really help you. I'm liking it a lot. I really think this product helped my skin to be more normal because I had more oily skin and I'm very uh, enjoying this product so I already repurchased it. Next I have this Palmer Coconut Oil uh, Lip Balm. So uh, this is again another finished product. Not my favorite, it's too creamy, it's wearing off too fast so not my favorite. Then I have the Loved and Beloved the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. You know, I love, I love this one. Um, this is finished, so uh, I will throw it away, but I will repurchase it at some point because this is my favorite mascara and it's still my favorite mascara. <laughs> then we have this uh, Makeup Forever pencil. I have a lot of uh, black pencils, so again, I can pass it to a friend and maybe they could uh, use it because it's a very pigmented uh, pencil, but yeah, it's a waste to keep it in my collection. And then I tested this product. This is the Clear Brow and Lash Mascara from e.l.f. I'm not really liking this product. I feel like I'm wetting my hairs and that's it. This is not keeping my uh, hairs up. Maybe if you have a more um, uh, lighter, <laughs> lighter brow hairs, maybe this can help you. Again, I'm passing this one to a friend because maybe they can like it. And the last product is the Ingo Dura line. I'm really liking this product, but if you can see, it's not empty. But I need to throw it away because it's old and I don't want to put it around my eyes. So these are all the products. And if you like the video, I hope you find it helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you next time.